the American dream was shot. During the last few months, many, many things have been exposed. Right now, one of the biggest is the American dream. And one of the reasons that the American dream was shot in the ass was false narratives. Once again, what is America? America is a corporation. And if you want to do well in America, you need to be a corporation. And this is one of the things that so many people don't understand. In a corporate environment, you need to behave with a corporate behavior. You need to have your holding company. You need to have your LLCs. You need to have your company. Because right now, let's go ahead and look what's happening with this potential second stimulus. All of the people in Congress are well off or rich. They're looking out for well off and rich people. They're not looking out for the average person because what do they do? They went on recess. Then they're like, oh, we'll vote on this July, potentially August. And they're dragging their feet because they only care about their corporate citizens. And if you're not a corporate citizen, they don't care about you. And what does this have to do with the American dream? The American dream has been reformatted. And the American dream used to be to buy a house, send your kids to college, have your kids do well or better than you did. That's no longer the American dream. The American dream is about ownership. As in my other video, the game is about ownership. One of the things that you have to look at, one of the things you have to understand is to facilitate the American dream, you gotta have some money. The American dream is not happening for broke folks. It's just not. This, these be the facts. This is the reality. This is how the game is set up. So for you to get a piece of the American dream, for you, for immigrants, the American dream is alive and well. You wanna know why? They come from third world countries. They come from nothing. So to leave an Indian village or an African village and to get a job in New York as a house cleaner and to have an apartment and to have cable television, that's a come up for them. But you, my dear American, you already got that. You're looking for more. But one of the things that's happening is the American dream is being reset. You're being downgraded unless you actively work against what is happening. If you actively understand what is happening, all of the economies in the world have been impacted by COVID-19. Every economy. Sweden, which did not close down, is still going to go through a recession because of human behavior. So. If you want to get your piece of the American dream, you need to start a business. I've said this before and many people are listening to me. Many people are not listening to me. Many people are having this crazy um, response to this because in this new economy, you're not going to be able to coast. In this new economy, you're not going to be able to hide in corporate America and make six figures for really not doing that much. What is happening with the American dream is you gotta be able to produce. You gotta be a creator. You gotta be able to go into an organization and make direct impact. Because there were many people back in the day who got a piece of the American dream, were able to hide in corporate America and actually retire and not really do that much. Those days are over. See, this is why I feel that certain people are like make America great again with Trump for a long time. You could be a white person in America and really do nothing special, significant, and really do well in life. But that's about social economic class because George Bush who was nowhere near as smart as Barack Obama had more money because George W. Bush 
was socialized to be rich. And that's a whole nother video. But one of the things you've got to understand, if you want a piece of the American dream, you need to get busy. You need to start something. You need to create something. You need to become an investor. You need to participate in the economy because I want you to look at who is getting the money from Congress. I think the American people got 350 billion. Wall Street got three trillion. And look, Wall Street's only 8,000 companies. They got trillions of dollars while the American people got peanuts. Look at who Congress is supporting with the money. The Fed is doing double monkey backflips all over the stock market. The repo thing is going on. Follow the money. American people got like 350 billion. Corporations got trillions, trillions, because that's how the game is played. So if you want to get the money, you need to become a corporate citizen. I know that you want to be regular. I know you just want to work a job. I know you just want to chill on the weekends. And for some of you, that's going to work. For most of you, it ain't going to work. It's just not because the American dream was shot in the ass. It was. So for those of you who are looking to reinvigorate yourself, if you're looking to create something, if you're looking to be better in the future, join me this Thursday at 7 p.m. for a live webinar. The link's below. I'm going to give you a little juice off and we're going to talk about how you need to retrain yourself to participate in this new economy. So that's all I got for you right now. Go ahead, check out this video, it's right here.